Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Gabby and I'm currently 23 and I am a live-in nanny for an awesome set of twin girls who are actually a very big fan of my channel. So hi girls, I know you're watching. With that being said, I wanted to go ahead and jump right into my June 15th paycheck cash envelope sinking fund stuffing. I'm gonna be honest, I've already tried to film this video twice and it hasn't gone very well. So I tried to re-pull out the cash that I had already stuffed. So if I have some of the denominations wrong, and I think I might've miscalculated, but we will see. Alrighty, so let me go ahead and zoom you guys in here. All right, so as you can see, I have zoomed you guys in. In my last video, I failed to mention that I actually have a school payment. Um, I forgot to put that in my last video, but this is for my summer classes, and it's my last one for my summer course, and that is gonna be $142. Um, I got really lucky this semester, and all of my books were free. That never happened, so I'm very, very thankful for that, and this semester, all I had to do was pay for the registration and my classes iTunes is going to be $15. I pay for the family plan for my whole entire immediate family to have. Netflix is $13. My phone bill this time around is going to be $25. This is half of my July payment for my phone bill. And my car insurance is going to be $83. This is also half of my car insurance. I wish both of these were so cheap, but they're just half. And that brings my total to $278. Um, I'm also not including how much I'm going to be saving in my actual like emergency fund savings. That I want to keep private for a little bit. I know I mentioned it in my last video, but just a slight change we have going on. And then moving on to cash envelopes. For groceries, I'm going to give myself $70 this time around. I've run out of like condiments and things that I don't typically need to purchase every single time, so giving myself extra $10. Gas is going to get $30. Spending will get its usual $25, as well as clothing will get its usual $20. And that brings my total to $145. Moving on down to sinking funds, future is getting $80. This is for next September when my boyfriend and I move out. Dogs is getting 40. Car maintenance is getting 100. Christmas is getting $50. Anthony, which is my boyfriend's sinking envelope for his birthday is getting 25. I'm the worst and I already bought him two more presents and have given them to him. So you're gonna see that I'm the worst with presents. I tend to give everyone theirs early. Dates is getting 25. Anniversary is getting $20. Presents is getting 25. Beauty is getting 20. As well as fun. Travel is getting 10. And medical is getting 15. All right, let's go ahead and get to stuffing my cash envelopes. All right, so here are all of my cash envelopes. But today I'm actually going to be stuffing my sinking funds first because like I said, I'm not too sure on my bill denominations because I did try to film this and then consolidate my bills and I just didn't like the way it turned out. So we're gonna start with my sinking funds first. The first being future, which is going to get $80. So that's going to get a 50 a 20 and a 10. Which brings my total to 50, 100, 150, 200, 20, 40, 60, 80, 3, 3, 10, which is awesome. Next we have dogs, and my dog Finley just recently got groomed, and this is getting 40, and I also had to buy new dog food for them. So the new total is 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 45, so 145 in dogs. 
Next we have car maintenance, which gets $100. Which brings my total to one, two, 250, three, 350, four, 455, $600 which makes me extremely, extremely happy. My goal is to have a thousand at least in this envelope pretty much at all times. Christmas is going to get $50, which brings my new total to 50, 70, 90, 110, 130, 150, 170, 190, 210. <laughs> So $210 for Christmas, which is awesome. I really want to get the people I love really good Christmas gifts this year. Anthony, which is my boyfriend's envelope, currently has $10 in it, and it's going to get a 20 and a 5, which brings our new total to 20, 25, 30, 35. All right, dates, it's getting 25 as well. So I have 20 and a five, and this envelope is currently empty. All right, anniversary is next, and that's getting a 20. This is an envelope I desperately need to relaminate, and I think I said that last time too. So it's getting a 20, which brings my new total to 20, 30, 35. Presents is also getting 25, so a 20 and a five. Which brings my new total to 20, 30, 35, 40. I need to get my dad a Father's Day present. Beauty is also getting $20. So we have 20, 30, 35. Fun is also getting 20, which brings my total to $40. Travel is getting $10. which brings my new total to 20, 40, 60, 80, 1, 20, 30, 35. All right, and last up is medical, and medical is getting $15. A 10, and a five, which brings my new total to 20, 40, 50, 55, 60 in my medical envelope. All right, and now we are gonna stuff my cash envelopes because like I said, I have the denominations a little wrong trying to consolidate bills, so let's go ahead and do these. Groceries is getting $70. So we're gonna do a 20, 40, 60, and 10. Come on. <laughs> Clothing is getting its regular 20. And we're actually gonna do two 10s. And there's still a twenty dollar. Oops. There's still a twenty dollar bill in here, which brings my new total for forty for clothing. Gas is going to get thirty, and I actually still have a five left over, so we're gonna do ten, fifteen, twenty, twenty-five. 30, and then I, like I said, I have a five still, which brings my new total to 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35. 
And then in my spending envelope, it's going to get the last $25 remaining. So just a 20 and a five. Alright everyone, that's all for my cash envelope and sinking fund stuffing. If you enjoyed the video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up and please consider subscribing. Um, thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys next time. Bye!